Hello, Sats. What's going on? Whoa. Today, we're going to do your love reading for you and your person, you guys. I love your energy. Wow. Um, so, let's see what's going on with you and your person, Sats. Um, if you are new here, remember to like the video if the video do resonate with you guys. I'll give it a big thumbs up here on YouTube so YouTube can see that you like the video, it resonates, and push the videos through into a bigger audience so the video can grow, so the channel can grow. And that's how I know as well that you guys enjoy the content and it messages does resonate with you. Um, and yeah, and you guys did it very well on your last video and the week before that too, so thank you. <laughs> thank you guys. Oh my goodness. I love you guys. All right, let's keep it going, um, Satch, and um, let's see what's going on, okay? All right, angels, what's going on with Satch and their person, please? Any messages that we have for Satch and their person? I'm a Satch, too. If I descended, I don't know if I told you guys that, so. Your energy is very calm, full. I love that energy. Okay, messages, please, angels. All right, so your first three cards is the Page of Swords, the Fool's card, and the Eight of Swords in reverse. So I do feel like there's some things that, you, that is going on with you and your person where you felt stuck in. I feel like this person lied to you a lot, okay? And um, nothing made sense in this relationship. I feel like you were like falling in every little hole. Every time you came out of a hole or dig yourself out, this person put you in another situation and another situation, okay? And I feel like for some of you, you had enough, okay? You were going to make a decision to leave this person, um, but you didn't have all the facts and all the answers, or maybe you just felt scared or felt stuck in a situation where you didn't have enough money, you didn't have anywhere to go, or you didn't have your stuff together. But I see that you freed yourself, so that is a good thing, okay? I feel like you're happy, you're taking a bold chance to move forward with your life and moving on all right the page of swords is here so this is your person's energy okay they're a very immature young energy that's coming through here i feel like you block this person and move forward okay but the fool scares me sometimes with you with any reading because this could also mean that you guys are open to jump into another relationship with each other um but i see that you're taking a chance on a new beginning so without thinking about it so i see manifestation here i see your person coming back in with this knight of pentacles here they're offering a legacy and trying to build one with you or continue to build one with you because this is something that they want okay i do not feel like this person has bad intentions because this is something that is this is how their feelings are coming through, okay? But I feel like you're in your own feelings right now and you're trying to just do you and live your life and work on you and yourself. And you're not really paying attention to this person, okay? But this person is very much manifesting you, manifesting you back into their lives because they feel like, hey, you and them belong together, okay? Um, so let's keep going here and see what's going on. Ooh, the 10th, wow, okay. Okay, so we have the Ten of Cups here. We have the Ace of Cups in reverse and the Three of Swords. Okay, and every time I see the Three of Swords, I see three people. And I always have to say this, three people, three swords, three people getting going through a broken heart, okay? So this is in the reverse. So this is telling me that you guys... You know, this, like, both, all three of you is deciding to move on with your life if if this is a third-party connection, okay? Um, is deciding to let this go and move on, okay? I do feel like you put a hold on this relationship with this Ace of Cups here. You're deciding to move, like, put this on hold for now because somebody wants a new beginning. And you know it's your person. They want a new beginning. They want a new love. They want a happy ending with you with this, uh, this Ten of Cups here. You know, look at y'all. The happy ending, the kids... You know, they want this. They want this. They do. They want a new beginning with you. But you're putting a hold on this because of trust issues, because of what they have done. They have broke your heart. Hmm. Wow, we have the Queen of Swords here in reverse, the Empress, and yeah, Three of Cups in reverse. This person brought somebody to your bed that you did not know about. Yeah. And it could be somebody that you, you've seen before. Somebody that was close. Like, not close to you. They're not your best friend. But there's somebody that you've seen before at a party or a cookout or something like that. Or it could be a neighbor. 
Okay, you you block you're blocking this person. You're deciding to move forward, to move forward with this. You don't look at them like someone that you want to spend the rest of your life with anymore. In the Empress, you know this person let you down. You know, let you down. All right, so let's keep going here. The two, oh, excuse me, I just burped. the two of swords here. Um, the Knight of Swords and the star. Oh, interesting. Huh? Look how stuff shifts. Okay, so I feel like your person wants to make peace with this, okay? There's going to be a decision that's going to be made. Uh, your person haven't made it yet, but they're going to charge in. They want to charge in with this, let's see what happens, or hopefully, you know, let's fix things. You know what I mean? Because they want to, they want to try to fight as much as they can or how they know how to fight. You know, um, I don't feel like this person knows how to, <sighs> how to have a long, long, long relationship. I feel like you're probably the longest relationship they ever had, like serious relationship or um, a relationship where they felt, felt things for someone um, because they're coming off really immature, like the Knight of Pentacles and the Knight of Swords here, okay? So I feel like this person is not a young, young person, but they're still young, like say in their 20s or 30s. I feel like they're not a wise person, like, you know, like the emperor. Emperors are older version, very successful, very focused, very, you know, let's go and get it kind of energy. Um, you know, the king of swords, the queen of swords, you know, those energies right there are very like, okay, let's do this. Let's be rational. Let's fix this kind of situation. No, this person is just doing it because they like to have fun with you. They like to, you know, like to be around you at this present time, or that's what they're feeling at this present time. Like they feel like, you, you know, right now they're probably not with you and they feel like they want to be with you because it felt right. It felt good. They liked being with you and they're trying to fight as much as they know how to fight for you. Okay. I do feel like there's a purpose why you guys are in each other's life with a star being here. There's a situation where you guys need to fix a conflict and this is why. Oh my goodness. So you guys are soulmate connection coming through. Two of Cups here, very strong pull, very in the reverse, which tells me, hey, you guys are not seeing eye to eye. You guys are separated. You know, this person again, juggling two things, <laughs> two people, not trying to make a decision. I feel like, you know, this person wants you back. I feel like you felt, you feel the same way for this person with this two of cups being here. It talks about mutual feelings, probably marriage in the future if it was in the upright. But right now you guys are going through a lot of stuff and you're going through thinking about like what's best for you kind of situation. So I don't see you taking this option right now because this person definitely has the two of pentacles and they're not trying to make a decision they're feeling like this two of pentacles is something that they can handle so if you don't know what i'm talking about two people going back and forth back and forth this person is enjoying this this time doing all of that okay and i feel like you are just gonna do you okay you are just do, gonna do you and you're gonna be very successful at it i feel like when you are single and focused and know what you want you accomplish more by yourself Okay, let's see what's going on in the back. Look at this. <laughs> so this person know, know that you are the person for them. They know that you are all that in a bag of chips. And they, they're really, they still have these plans for this relationship. You know, but here comes the options. Okay, to cheat in and flirt in in the numbers. And again, it's in the upright. This person does not want to make a decision. But yet the world and the devil okay the devil secrets for some of you this person is probably already married going through a divorce or stuck into a relationship where they feel like the you know all their money's tied up to this person you know there will be an apology you know about this because i feel like this person didn't tell you everything you know again with the lies and betrayal with this eight of swords you didn't know all the facts this person was just putting you through little holes, holes, holes every time just to keep you there. But you climb out of those holes and then they try to put you in another hole <laughs> to keep your to keep your your eyes from seeing what's really going on. <laughs> but you figure it out. You figure it out. <laughs> 
Oh my goodness. I hope this, guys, I hope this resonates. Um, if it does, go ahead and like this video. Give this video a big thumbs up here on YouTube. And I will continue to make videos for you. And if you guys continue to like the videos that I do push out, I will make a longer reading which is a full reading um for you i just want to see how these videos go first with you guys um and then we'll take it from there okay i love you guys remember you don't have to stay with anyone that you don't want to if you don't want this person you don't have to be with them heal angels will see when you're ready and bring somebody new that your energy is vibrating okay if your energy is vibrating if you think that you don't deserve something and no one knows about this like when you 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 obtain what you you vibrate okay so if you're if you think if you love yourself and you and you know what you deserve you're going to vibrate that energy but if you have doubts within yourself and you just want to be with someone and you don't know what what really did, did you want that's what your 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 energy is going to vibrate those kind of people and those kind of people don't even know what they want so it cause like friction you know what i'm saying so please know that it's all up to you, okay? Love you guys, and I'll see you guys in your next one. Bye, guys.